I'm not focused on his face. I'm not focused on details, shading, texture, anything like that. I'm just trying to capture the pose without it looking like a stick figure or a robot, okay? So once I draw it, I'll go through it again with you guys. Say go, I'm gonna draw. Now what I want you guys to do is watch me and the board. See if you can kind of watch both or watch one or the other, okay? But I want you to try to really look and see how I'm doing this, what it's gonna yep. look like. Go. Okay, so I've got Brian's head, I've got his shoulders, this is 10 seconds, here's his knee going across, I've got his arm, there's his hand going on that, and his foot's there, tied. Okay, so, do you guys think that sort of looks like his pose? I'm going to walk through what I did, okay? So, first off, what did you guys notice, if anyone was watching me, what I did? You weren't looking. I wasn't looking at the board. I maybe glanced like once the whole time, okay? I was looking at him. Remember what we got? It? I talked to you guys about observation. Draw from observation, draw from life. The more you look at things, the more you're going to understand how the world works and what things actually look like versus your brain tricking you. So what I did here was I started with his head. You can see this is my start of my line here. So I just said, okay, here's his head. I didn't care about if it was a perfect circle, if it was his face, like the perfect shape of it. I just wanted to get his head in there. Then I picked up my pen here and started here. If you guys, does anyone remember what I said when I was at this point? His shoulders. His shoulders. I said, okay, now here's his shoulders. So I went, followed this line, okay? I wanted to make sure that I kind of got where his neck was, but that I was able to figure out what angle his shoulders were at, okay? So I looked at the angle that it's up or down on either side and how far out his shoulders were okay probably his shoulders need to be a little bit more broad but i only had 10 seconds this one arm that kind of went this way and this right here was his hand so i tried to kind of show that his hand was hanging off the edge of the chair here so some information was a little bit missing um but that was kind of the gesture that i got in there um then i kind of went across said okay here's his torso and I tried to get his hips, that's his hip line. Now the way he was sitting, he had one foot, one knee up and the, the foot across the knee. So I followed the line here, there's his knee, and obviously that's like a curved line, but there's kind of this line here where I had tried to put his foot. Okay, so that's like his heel, that's his toes, and then I wanted to put the other leg in here and the angle of his foot that was resting on the bottom of the chair. Did I even draw the chair? No. No. I didn't draw the chair at all originally. I was just focused on his pose and what it looked like. Um, and then I did have his arm in here a little bit, so um, it was going down that way.